Actually, we compare the Punisher to Gandhi because uh, our guy's way more hardcore than the Punisher. Hey guys, welcome back to another interview here on Tone In Entertainment. Today we're at Florida Supercon and I'm joined by H.H. German, creator of Calico. How are you doing? Doing well, comic book fans. Thank you for supporting our fight against animal abuse. Yeah, let's talk about Calico because we were walking by, we saw this booth, you caught us over here, and you have a really great story about this comic. Calico gets intel on people who abuse and kill animals. He goes after them with extreme justice. You love animals and you hate animal abuse, you're going to love this series. There's a lot of uh, articles out there about the Calico, and uh, you know, here comes Calico. We're all about fighting anim animal abuse through comics and manga. Now, you mentioned, you asked me if we knew who the Punisher was. What does the Punisher and, you know, Calico... Like, what is the difference between those two? Sure. A lot of people, when they see the character, they think of Black Panther just because he has, you know, cat ears and he has dark colored costume. But he's probably the farthest thing from the Black Panther. Black Panther's a superhero. But Calico's more like the Punisher. He's a vigilante. He goes after people who, who do bad things. In uh, this case, bad things to animals. So he's really someone who loves animals. He's not really a people person, but uh, he's definitely an animal person. So he loves animals, and he goes after them with extreme, and I mean extreme justice, which is why there's more of a, a reference to the Punisher instead of, you know, Black Panther. Was there a particular reason um, you started up this comic book series? Yes, I'm a former boxer from the Bronx, and a lot of the story has to do with my background. I came across a few people who uh, abused animals back in the day, and the, the Calico's also a boxer from the Bronx. So there's a lot of, uh, you know, they say write what you know, and I know how to fight and I know about comics, so uh, we decided on this project. Now, just like The Punisher, Calico is a straight mature comic book. Oh, well, certainly, absolutely. This is rated M for mature. In fact, uh, Screen Rant uh, did a couple of articles on us and they continue to do articles about us and they do the comparison about uh, the Calico being the Punisher for animals. And uh, we compare him to, uh, actually we compare the Punisher to Gandhi because uh, our guy's way more hardcore than the Punisher, so. Which he should be. There you go. Bro, where can people check out the comic if they're not here at the convention? Go to your local comic book shop. They will have Here Comes Calico. And if they don't, simply tell the comic book shop owner, hey, why is there no Here Comes Calico on the shelves? Get it, and they will order it through the previews catalog. Every, every uh, comic book shop has a previews catalog, and that's where they order their comics. And Here Comes Calico from Sigma Comics is definitely there. Tell them. Where's Here Comes Calico? We want Here Comes Calico. Because there are eight issues out now. There are six issues out. Seven's coming out in a couple of months, and it will be a doozy. So you guys look out for it. Get on, get on it right now. That's right. All right, guys, if you like interviews like this, make sure you hit that red subscribe button so you can stay tuned in here to Tone In Entertainment for future videos. Subscribe to the channel. Do it. Go now. Do it now.